The final part of this online lesson deals with printing uh, a time distance chart uh, to paper. In this specific example, we would like to print uh, the chart to A3 landscape paper. If we proceed to the uh, Tylos Explorer, and by clicking on the uh, view with uh, resource data, we can then return back to uh, our main working area with the resource data included in uh, the whole plan. If we then reduce the size of the plan in the main toolbar to uh, 25% and by clicking on the uh, show print pages icon and then by clicking on the print settings we can then choose print on one page option and we can see here that the, uh, the print calculates at 104% of the actual uh, page size. However, uh, we can see if we move the print settings slightly away to the, uh, the right hand side, we can actually see uh, that the sheet does not totally fit the borders. So if we uh, then tick the box print on one page and uh, reduce the size to 100% and click on OK. We can then adjust uh, the size according to uh, the borders, the perimeters that we move in. So uh, using your mouse, just again click on the, uh, the spacer symbol and uh, up here uh, just slightly to uh, your right hand side. We, uh, we now have an, an output uh, format uh, that we can then print in a moment. It is also worth mentioning here that we can actually change the column width and height uh, values in the details toolbar below on the, uh, the left hand side and on the right hand side. The last line shown here where my, uh, my mouse arrow is the last line shows the width of the total drawing. So now basically we can finally start uh, printing this plan to paper. Finally, by changing the start and end coordinates in uh, the details toolbar at uh, the bottom of our screen in the uh, cell settings uh, view tab, I can uh, reduce um, the area which I would like to show uh, on a different scale uh, within the project and um, in addition uh, to this the pictures uh, basically that uh, have been drawn uh, in the plan uh, can also be clipped too. So if I uh, would like to uh, change my start and end coordinates to 2000 meters uh, to example uh, 3000 meters and hitting return I can uh, see that uh, graphically the view that I wish to print uh, has now been reduced in accordance with the start and end coordinates. The, uh, the graphics uh, above, as you can see here, uh, have also uh, been clipped um, accordingly. And um, the reason for this is that I can provide uh, a level of detail of a plan uh, either for my uh, work crews in the field or for example uh, a contractor or management or stakeholders. Uh, this is the reason basically uh, for uh, doing this. So uh, we have now reached the, uh, the end of this uh, online tutorial. I would like to uh, thank you for your uh, time.